10 homemade organic pesticides. Ever wonder what farmers did hundreds of years ago to fight off crop pests? Long before the invention of harmful chemical pesticides, yes, the kind that is linked to cancerous cellular activity, farmers and householders came up with multiple remedies for removing insect infestations from their garden plants. The following list will offer some of our favorite, all-natural, inexpensive, organic methods for making bug-busting pesticides for your home garden. Number 1. Neem Ancient Indians and Chinese highly revered neem oil as a powerful, all-natural plant for warding off pests. In fact, neem juice is the most powerful natural pesticide on the planet, holding over 50 natural insecticides. You can use this extremely bitter tree leaf to make a natural pesticidal spray. To make your own neem oil spray, Add one half an ounce of high quality organic neem oil and one half teaspoon of a mild organic liquid soap, I use Dr. Bronner's peppermint, to two quarts of warm water. Stir slowly. Add to a spray bottle and use immediately. Number 2. Salt Spray. For treating plants infested with spider mites. Mix two tablespoons of Himalayan crystal salt into one gallon of warm water and spray on infected areas. Number 3. Mineral Oil. Mix 10 to 30 ml of high-grade oil with one liter of water. Stir and add to spray bottle. This organic pesticide works well for dehydrating insects and their eggs. Number 4. Citrus Oil and Cayenne Pepper This organic pesticide works well on ants. Mix 10 drops of citrus essential oil with 1 teaspoon cayenne pepper and 1 cup of warm water. Shake well and spray on the affected areas. Number 5 Soap, Orange Citrus Oil, and Water To make this natural pesticide, Simply mix 3 tablespoons of liquid organic castile soap with 1 ounce of orange oil to 1 gallon of water. Shake well. This is an especially effective treatment against slugs and can be sprayed directly on ants and roaches. Number 6. Eucalyptus Oil. A great natural pesticide for flies, bees, and wasps. Simply sprinkle a few drops of eucalyptus oil where the insects are found. They will all be gone before you know it. Number 7. Onion and Garlic Spray. Mince one organic clove of garlic and one medium-sized organic onion. Add to a quart of water. Wait one hour and then add one teaspoon of cayenne pepper and one tablespoon of liquid soap to the mix. This organic spray will hold its potency for one week if stored in the refrigerator. Number 8. Chrysanthemum Flower Tea. These flowers hold a powerful plant chemical component called pyrethrum. This substance invades the nervous system of insects, rendering them immobile. You can make your own spray by boiling 100 grams of dried flowers into 1 liter of water. Boil dried flowers in water for 20 minutes. Strain, cool, and pour into a spray bottle. Can be stored for up to 2 months. You can also add some organic neem oil to enhance the effectiveness. Number 9. Tobacco Spray. Just as tobacco is hazardous to humans, Tobacco spray was once a commonly used pesticide for killing pests, caterpillars, and aphids. Mix one cup of organic tobacco, preferably a brand that is organic and all natural, into one gallon of water. Allow the mixture to set overnight. After 24 hours, the mix should have a light brown color. If it is very dark, add more water. This mix can be used on most plants, 
except those in the solanaceous family, tomatoes, peppers, eggplants, etc. Number 10. Chili Pepper Slash Diatomaceous Earth Grind two handfuls of dry chilies into a fine powder and mix with one cup of diatomaceous earth. Add to two liters of water and let set overnight. Shake well before applying. Thank you for watching. Share us your thoughts by commenting below. Also don't forget to share this video to your friends and family and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next video.